Hello my loves, welcome to your love reading for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. I hope everyone is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages for my Aquarius, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Clarity, Guidance, and Love Messages for my Aquarians, please. Spirit, what do my Aquarians need to know for this upcoming Mercury retrograde, please? Spirit? Spirit. Clarity, guidance, love messages for my Aquarius, please. What do my Aquarians need to know for this upcoming Mercury retrograde? So we have the Justice card, Libra energy, and we have the Seven of Swords. We have the Ten of Wands, and we have the Four of Wands. We have the Two of Swords. We have the Two of Cups. We have the Ten of Swords, and we have the Tower. Aries energy, Scorpionic energy. We have the Six of Swords. We have the Four of Cups. We have the Two of Wands and the Eight of Swords. Aquarius, I feel like what's happening during this Mercury retrograde. Now, I don't know if it's you that's going through this or, you know, someone else, but someone here is getting their karma. Someone here either dipped and gave up on a connection, like someone just like left a marriage or was living with someone and just ghosted, like moved out, like just left someone flat, dead, desolate. You know what I'm saying? Um, or someone here maybe has a family and they're putting their family through a really hard time because they're being very deceptive and very sneaky and just very trifling type of energy here. Someone's paying their karma. I feel like someone is coming to the realization that they ended things with a soulmate, that they hurt someone that they loved and they should have been with. And it's hitting this person so hard. It's sitting this person so hard that the mistake that they made by leaving someone behind. Um, I feel like someone wants to come in and put forth an offer. OK, I feel like someone wants to leave, let bygones be bygones and put forward like a peace offering. OK, someone is making this decision because they can't stand being separated from this person anymore. Someone here is infatuated. And not only that, but they're chained to their guilt. They're chained to these feelings of I know I messed up. Do you understand? We've got the nine of swords. We have the seven of wands. And we have the seven of pentacles. Yeah, someone here is not doing well because they had the opportunity to invest in something and they didn't. They had the opportunity to um, make something happen here, to, to have their happiness and their joy. And they pushed it at, away at some point in time. The strength card, Leo energy, the hierophant. This person should have committed in this connection. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Someone here pulled away from their divinely guided soulmate. Someone here should have committed when they had the chance. Um, either someone wasn't ready for commitment or someone pulled away from a soulmate. Someone here, you know, could have been married and they left their marriage. Three of Cups, the Four of Pentacles, and the Page of Wands. Um, I feel... I feel like someone here wants to come in and apologize for not giving to this connection, for pulling away from this connection, for being greedy, for being selfish. Um, maybe someone here started talking to a third party and withdrew from this connection and now they regret it, Aquarius. Now that could be you, that could be your person. The Hermit, Virgo energy, the Eight of Cups, the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy, and the Eight of Pentacles. I feel like Aquarius, what's happening? here is someone's withdrawing someone is starting to emotionally disconnect i feel like someone has been trying to work on a connection for a long time like someone really waited someone really tried someone was a hard worker someone really put in the elbow grease to make this work and now someone's starting to feel that emotional disconnect we have the moon cancer piscean energy we have the star aquarian energy the lover's card and the ten of cups i feel like 
someone is starting to see the truth. Someone is starting to see the truth. Someone is starting to ask themselves, what if I would have made things work? Because with the star card, the lover's card, and the ten of cups, someone is starting to see someone as their wish fulfillment. Someone is starting to see, maybe someone is, is going public or is public. Someone here may be a healer possibly, um, but they have a very healing vibe to them, right? A very spiritual healing vibe to them. Um, and again, a very strong soulmate connection here, divinely guided soul tie. I feel someone is is living in this land of, you know, what if I would have made it work? Someone's intuition is saying this is the person that I want. Um, we have the four of swords here. We have the six of wands. And we have temperance. I feel like someone is coming back, Aquarius. Now that could be you going back to somebody or someone's coming back to you. Someone wants to extend a knot. Someone wants to make peace here. Someone wants to be forgiven. We have the Ace of Wands and we have the Nine of Pentacles. I feel it could be possible for some of you that um, pre empress energy, Virgo energy, someone here has started a new career or someone here has grown into a pre empress. Someone here has maybe uh, gotten their money up. They look good. They feel good. Someone's on fire. Then that's what happened here. I feel like someone grew into this amazing person. Uh, in the past, this person was left behind like they were nothing. And now they've grown into this amazing person. And I feel like there's a sense of regret. You know what I'm saying? Because this person could be standing by this pre empress's side. We've got the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, the Sun card, Leo energy, and the Six of Cups. I feel like this ex is coming in to tell you that, Aquarius, or you're going in to tell this to somebody i realize now that you know i love you someone's coming in with an apology i see you now you know what i'm saying we have the devil capricorn energy we have the queen of cups cancer scorpio pisces energy and the five of cups someone here is still obsessed with you aquarius or you are still obsessed with someone um could be a water sign doesn't have to be but this is um someone who still has a lot of emotion here a lot of emotion and it's turning toxic because this person is just drowning and, and swallowing in regret. They're just drowning and wallowing in regret. Um, there could be stalking happening here because someone here has glowed up. Someone here has come up. Someone here... Um, you know, it, it's just impossible to not see this person. Everyone is talking about this person. You know, they're on social media, maybe. Um, uh, you know, so if, if someone may be very public with how their glow up is going, you know, and I feel like there's a lot of jealousy here. There's a, like someone here, you know, feels like they missed an opportunity. We've got the Wheel of Fortune and the Knight of Wands. Someone is rushing in to get their blessings. Someone is, uh, yeah, a judgment card, second chance, Page of Swords. I feel like someone may hit this person up online. It's especially if you live at a distance, but someone is coming to this awakening of, I need to go back and try again. I need to go back and try again. We've got the High Priestess, Cancer, Piscean Energy, and the Death card, Scorpionic Energy. Um, I feel like someone's intuition knows that if they if this should come back together again, it won't be the same as it was before. Because again, there's a lot of growth here. You Both of you have grown a lot since this connection has ended. There's a tremendous amount of growth here. And someone just knows, like, if I were to try again, I know it would be different between us. We've got the Ace of Cups and we have the uh, six of pentacles i feel that um, someone here may be moved on to a new connection they moved on to a new connection but they don't give that new person the love that was in this connection do you see what i'm saying like they breadcrumb that newer person we've got the three of swords and the five of wands yet yeah, this new they're in a connection now someone went on moved on to a newer connection where there's a lot of heartache a lot of cheating a lot of lies deception a lot of fighting a lot of jealousy um so someone here is really facing their karma okay someone here is really facing their karma we've got the nine of wands and the five of swords someone here is tired of pretending like they've won do you understand what i'm saying so a disconnect a, a disconnect happened here and i feel like someone was trying to save face like oh yeah no i'm doing good i'm with this new person we're good we're great meanwhile the connection is a freaking disaster and they're still in love with their ex 
Do you see, do you see what I'm saying? So someone is coming in to speak their truth, Aquarius. <clears throat> that may be you going towards someone or someone coming towards you. But I feel like if you guys um, reconciled, it would really be different this time around because there's a tremendous amount of growth. Okay. I love you guys. Bye.